The Roswell Historic District is in danger of losing its character, charm, and identity. Right now, Citizens for Responsible Development in Roswell, CRDR, is working to protect our historic district by ensuring that proper review procedures are followed by using Roswell's historic district design guidelines. In November of 2015, the Historic Preservation Commission approved the Vickers development without using the historic district guidelines as required by state law and the city's own code. As a result, Vickers as approved will be two massive three and a half story buildings at the corner of Canton Street and Woodstock Road. Most large developments in the historic district are subject to review by an independent architect. Among other things, the Vickers review found the mass, scale, and building setbacks to be completely out of context with the existing character of the street. As proposed, this development will ruin the sense of place and historic value of Upper Canton Street, the very things that preservation law and guidelines are meant to preserve. In December of 2015, CRDR and Sally McKenzie filed an appeal to Roswell City Council. The city attorney denied their standing based on local zoning ordinances rather than preservation law. This means that, right now, citizens in Roswell with an interest in this protected historic resource cannot speak out when they believe their local representatives have acted inappropriately. Our historic district is small and fragile. The Mimosa and Dolphin properties are two key properties that further illustrate the irreparable damage that can occur because the very guidelines that are meant to protect this historic public resource are not being used. With Vickers, we have to stop this detrimental pattern. We must hold our local government and representatives accountable for their actions. CRDR and Mrs. McKenzie are appealing to Fulton County Superior Court on July 1st to secure their right to appeal to Roswell City Council. If we are denied this right, this decision could be used across the state to shut out citizens from rightfully using the law to protect their historic neighborhoods. We need your support. Please consider a donation and please share this.